We are now in Chinatown. And during this trip, we are staying at Pura, Purama City Center. It's the most convenient for us because everything is near. MRT, food, going to places, even going to Sentosa Island, um, Boat Key, Clark Key. So this is my second time here in Singapore. And the last trip I stayed somewhere not too far, too far from Orchard Road. But I think staying in Chinatown is the best choice for us. We're able to go to many places. But then again, you better prepare because a lot of walking. You can maximize your time here. This is our first time to travel with my first grandchild. It's her first international travel. She's eight months old. And if you follow my travel vlogs with my family, it's always just us. And She's the daughter of my eldest boy. And then Danny, who just turned 19, last Feb, he will be returning to LA in a few weeks, uh, actually in a week time. Because university starts end of this month, August. And so, I do not know on our next um, international travel if he will be able to join us. This one has my camera, right? Yeah. So enjoy this um, vlog, guys. This is a family vlog. Well, my channel is always about my family and our travels and events to document our happenings so we are still in this um, small alley it's early it's around 9 38 a.m. on a Saturday so I guess because it's early the stores are closed so if you come here in the afternoon or late afternoon till evening then this place must be very busy here's my princess little princess <laughs> Mata mm. There are only two Chinatowns that I have been to. Of course, in Bangkok and here <laughs> in Singapore. But it's so different in terms of organized and cleanliness, obviously. So I guess this place is called Chinatown Heritage Center. Of course, we've been to China <laughs> several times. But then, if you travel to Bangkok, you visit Chinatown in Bangkok because the dynamics is just fantastic.
And also staying here in Chinatown is also not far from Marina Bay Sands.